I'm a stay so tried spiritual healer back to give you guys a message. This message is gonna be for the sign of Aries. Hi Aries, love you guys so much. Sorry about yesterday, guys. I got so overwhelmed and booked with readings. My energy was really gone after the last reading, Aries. I was done. Like I literally went to sleep. I fell asleep early. I was supposed to get you guys a reading, but my energy was drained. I had a get some rest and come back with you guys with, with all the energy I always bring to the Aries. I love you so much, baby boss. Thank you for all of you guys that have been booking readings with me. I enjoy talking to you guys. You guys are so hilarious. You guys have me laughing and cracking up on the readings because you guys have been gaining so much truth. Aries, you guys have been gaining so much clarity in your situation. I know all the information that I gave you guys regarding um, your situations for the people that booked with me. I know it was a little bit shocking. It was uh, really resonated with you guys. You guys were very surprised with the information because you guys, you guys been needing these answers, Aries. And now that you guys got the answers, Aries, and you guys know about the sneaky people in your life. Yeah, Aries, you know about the sneaky people. Sneak, sneak. Yeah, you guys know. So you guys know all the truth about the sneaky people, okay? You guys got your clarity. You guys are getting your justice right now because you guys did the work, my loves. You broke the spell, like I said before. Congratulations. I love you guys. I'm so proud of you because you really broke the spell, my love. The spell is broken, Aries. So now you are going to have all these opportunities, Aries. Yes. Wait till I get my money right. La, 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 la. Then you can't tell me nothing, right? Aries, look at all those options. Look at all those cups of love. Look at all those gifts the universe is sending you. Your 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 business is gonna take off. Aries, start that business. You guys, for you guys that started your business, your business is picking up pace. Spirits and angels are backing you up in any endeavor that you guys um, pursue. Aries, you guys have won all these gifts and all these trophies. You're the walking trophy, my love. I'm the walking trophy. You guys are the walking trophy. You guys are the gift. You guys are the love, and you guys are being chosen. Okay? You guys are chosen. Not only chosen by the Most High, Aries, but you're being chosen by a Hierophant energy, by a Taurus energy. This Hierophant is a very wise spiritual sage. This Hierophant is choosing you, Aries, to collaborate with you on a spiritual partnership or business or whatever business that you are starting or you're working on. It doesn't have to be spiritual, but it's a good business that's going to help people, Aries. You guys are humanitarians. You guys come from... um higher dimensional energies, Aries, you guys are uh, also in the Hierophant energy because you guys are turning into the High Priest, receiving your abundance, receiving your spiritual gifts, receiving everything that the Most High has for you, and this Hierophant wants to partner with you, Aries, yes, congratulations, your finances look beautiful, your abundance is always, like, never going to be blocked again, you broke the spell, Aries, so whoever was trying to deceive you, whoever was trying to plot on you, Whoever um, was doing um, energy magic um, or even doing full moon rituals against you, um, hello, this is no longer working. So if you're doing this to the Aries, I suggest you go um, beg God to forgive you because your karma is starting now. Aries, these people, their karma is starting now because you know the truth. And when you get the truth, that's it. The truth sets you free, okay? The truth brings judgment, okay? So yes, that's what's going on. You're getting judgment in your situation, Aries. Yes, because you guys, you're receiving communication. You're receiving a message from a messenger that wants to come in and tell you that they would like to collaborate, that they have some information, that they need you to sign some documents, that you might need to travel. But all this is bringing you your abundance and your gifts, Aries. With the Ace of Wands, you guys are getting this unexpected good news, a windfall of money, an unexpected offer, collaboration, partnership, Aries. This is everything to you guys. This person could be an Aries Leo Sag that's communicating, Aries. It could be a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or it could be um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? But um, nonetheless, Aries, okay? Here goes the Knight of Wands. This is someone that, um, Aries, that you guys probably left behind because this person, you found out the truth about this person. This person was in and out of your life. This person was fickle. And now, Aries, this person sees you winning. This person sees you that you're abundant. This person has been learning from you guys as well. Or this person has some message that they want to tell you. They really need to talk to you. Because you guys been blocking this person out. This is what I'm getting. You guys been blocking out this, 
this person and this person's turning into the Knight of Swords. This person is feeling some type of way, Aries. Yes, they're feeling some type of way because now you're not letting this person into your energy because you know about the energy vampires. You know about um, you know about um, people's intentions, Aries. You guys are so wise right now. You guys are um, increasing um your your third eyes are awake, Aries. Your chakras are awake and beautiful. If you guys did the meditations I send you when you booked your reading. Then let me tell you some. This Knight of Swords person, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, energy, they're very, very um, hasty. They're coming towards you very quickly, Aries, because they see you receiving the blessings. They see you receiving the Nine of Cups. They feel like you're leaving them out in the cold. They feel like you're not, there's no going back. They feel like they, they lost you for good, Aries. And this person is coming in very regretful with the Knight of um, Swords to communicate. Aries, if this person communicates to you with immature communication, I just want to let you guys know, block them right away. You don't need to explain nothing to this person. At the end of the day, this person chose someone else. This person went the other way while you were um, while you were vulnerable, Aries. You were vulnerable at the time when you met this person. You were vulnerable when you were giving this person your love. When you needed love yourself, you gave this person love. You gave this person your trust. And this person clearly broke it. This person didn't take you seriously. They thought they were going to come in, get what they wanted, and leave, just like this. But it backfired on their ass, Aries. Mm -hmm. When they found out you was, when they found out that you was the queen or the king, the goddess and the empress, or the emperor, they found out that they chose wrong. Like I said, that grass was fake, okay? So if they went somewhere else, mm -mm. this person is very regretful. This person is in their feelings. You haven't been reaching out. This person probably watching you online. This person sees you having all these options. And now they want to come back. But Aries, all I got to say is use your discernment. You don't need to take no one back. Okay? Especially no one that didn't value you, Aries. Especially when you needed them the most and you weren't doing so good. Aries, what I'm getting is this person chose someone else. So this person could have went towards someone that had more money than you at the time. Okay? Because Aries, you guys were finding yourselves. You guys were going through the most because people put you there. They sabotage you, family members and friends and exes. But Aries, you turned into the Queen of Pentacles, and this person left you for a Queen of Pentacles energy. This person left you for someone that had more money. And they're very regretful because now you turned into the Empress or the Emperor. You you stepped up your game. You 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 joined the fight. You, you wakened yourself, Aries. Yes, you started healing. Now you're abundant. Everything's going in your favor, and this person's losing their freaking mind because they know that the more that you win, the, the farther you are from them. They're, you're so far from this person's reach, they're literally losing their mind. They're literally talking to themselves how they're going to come back in, Aries, okay? But I don't see you going backwards. I see you going forward. I see you celebrating. I see you rejoicing. I see you in your um, grateful, abundant energy when you get this beautiful unexpected opportunity or windfall that's coming Aries because the wheel of fortune is in your favor love the angels are calling judgment on your situation okay you're getting your justice your recognition you you guys are getting recognized by um other people that are admiring you that you're helping other people Aries you're in your um starseed energy I love this beautiful energy my loves yes you're gonna be victorious there's no need to worry Aries just go do your meditations because you're going to be victorious. You are already you already won, Aries. You broke the spell and you're receiving assets. You're receiving a new home. You're receiving abundance. You're receiving all the gifts from the Most High. Yes, because you work for this shit and you earned it. Okay, Aries. And Aries, I just heard this song, Aries. I don't know if this is you guys, but what I, what I know about Aries, because I'm Aries, okay? Aries is very loyal. Aries is very dedicated when they love someone or when they're passionate about someone or something that they're doing, okay? So Aries, there's no looking back. You found your calling. If you found your spiritual purpose, if you actually woke up to the truth about what these people were doing in your life to try to stop your blessing, then you're definitely not going back to that, okay? Because you're looking for someone that's willing to stay. You're looking for someone that's loyal. You're looking for someone that you can count on. Aries, that won't back out of your life when you are not doing so well that won't leave you stuck when you need them the most aries someone that's gonna put the work in yes because you guys are in this energy like if someone comes up to you aries and they start investing in you and you see that this person is loyal aries you're gonna stay so if you had to walk away from people they gave you no choice okay because you're the queen you're the emperor you're loyal 
Your love is unconditional and it lasts forever. But these people broke it in so many pieces that, that you couldn't fix it no more. You don't got to fix it. That's not your job to fix their mess. It ain't your job to clean their street, Aries. Let them deal with their mess. Let them deal with their garbage. Let them deal with the shit they put out. And let them get their karma. And you just keep moving forward. Okay? Because you're looking for someone that's willing to stay. Okay, Aries? Yes. And I'm hearing this song by Lumi D. And this is like the song that says, If you want me to stay, I'll never leave. If you want me to stay, love endlessly. If you want me to stay, I'll never leave. If you want me to stay, if you want me to stay, I'll never leave you. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Yeah, you guys are loyal, Aries. You guys will stay. If somebody loves you, if somebody treats you right, you guys always are gonna stay. You guys don't just up and leave people because you're selfish. If you leave someone every just because they did the most to you, okay? You want somebody that's willing to stay. If you want me to stay, I'm gonna love leave you, uh-oh. I love that song by Lumi D. Aries. I'm gonna get some more messages for you guys, my beautiful Aries from this deck, to clarify those messages that came out. I'm sorry, guys, if you don't like my singing. I'm a, I'm a vibrant person. Music is in my soul. Um, I'm a very lyrical person. I write poetry. Um, my, my, my music is inspiring to me. So when I sing in Dern, your reading is because I'm having such beautiful energy. I'm picking up on this celebration energy, guys. So continue to do that. Beautiful uh, healing. I love you guys. And let's get some more clarity, my loves. Give me some more energy, spirit guides, angels, ancestors, the highest white light. Spirit out and uh, please connect, connect with me clearly and clarify those messages that came out from my beautiful Aries, my baby bosses. Please clarify the energy that's coming towards my beautiful Aries. Yes. Thank you, spirit. Okay, Aries. Wow. Can't make this shit up, bro. Okay, my love. So here goes, here goes, here goes. So, Aerie, you guys, right now, you guys are standing your freaking ground, and I don't blame you, as you should. You're standing your ground with this Queen of Swords energy, my loves, and people can notice you standing your ground, okay? Your adversaries, they see you standing your ground. They know the warrior has risen for the fight, Aries. Yeah, they know you're the warrior and you rose for the fight. They know you're like, come on, come on, bring it. Bring it. I'm strong now. Let's see what you got, okay? So whoever whoever got to come towards you, they better come correct. That's what I'm getting. Because this Knight of Wands that came, is coming towards you, okay? This person could be a little more immature. Aries may be a little younger, whatever. This person was from your recent past. And they're coming towards you because they want to talk to you, okay? But you're like this. You're like this. Look, if you're coming towards me, you better come correct. You better not come towards me with no damn McDonald's either. Wow, Aries. Yeah, you could buy that for yourself, my love. But anyways, yeah, this, this, there's this King of Swords. I guess this person has, this person is giving me a vibe of someone that has gained their knowledge or wisdom, that has, that has gained some type of spiritual knowledge, or um, that wants to communicate to you, Aries, clearly, and wants to bring you the truth, because this person already knows you ain't playing for no games, okay? So let's see who this, who this, who's this energy spirit that wants to come communicate with Aries and give them some sort of truth, my love. Yeah. Yep. Yep. This is the same person. Uh huh. I'm Mr. Lonely. I have nobody. Call my own. Aries, this is the one that was juggling you. This is the same one that didn't choose you. This is the same energy that put you on the back burner and, and, and had you on standby. And you guys was not about to wait. And they were juggling you and someone else. Aries. Yeah, and the angels called judgment on their ass and gave them some sort of karma. I guess now they realize who you are and how powerful you are, Aries. They got res now you gained your respect from this person. Mm -mm. Yeah, and um, this person sees you winning, stable, doing good, Aries. And uh, I don't know if they want to come back because they want a piece of the pie. Aries, if they didn't work for that pie with you, if they didn't bake that pie with you, please. Ain't no pie for you, son. There ain't no pie for you. Okay, because look, this person feels defeated. This person feels mad defeated. They feel like um, you got you 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 are on a new level. I'm on a new level. I'm on a new level. Every you're on a new level, and this person's feeling defeated. Okay, that's what I'm getting. 
and it's very clear in this message, okay? There's a lot of people, more than one, Aries, they're feeling defeated because you moved away from them, because you gained the knowledge and wisdom and you retreated your energy. You retreated yourself from their lives. And now they're sick, okay? Because all you're doing is working, 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 paying attention to your pentacles, paying attention to your blessings, to your abundance, and to everything that you're manifesting right now. And, and you're in your nine of pentacles energy. You're too busy working. She work hard for the money. So hard for it, honey. I work hard for the money. You better treat her all right. All right, Aries. Yeah, because you know your value. You know your worth. You know how hard you work for this, my love. And that's why, woo, with the temperance. Beautiful Aries. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius, but they and their feelings. Because the angels are bringing you your will of fortune. Because you work for it. Yes. Yes, you worked for it. But now you're going all the way up, Aries. There goes. Beautiful energy. Okay, so someone's very... Re there's few people. I'm going to be honest. There's more than one. There's a few people that are so salty. That's what I got. Salty. Like some damn corn chips. Aries, they're salty. They need some, they need some juice. They need some of your juice, Aries, that beautiful energy that you gave them before. They're so salty that they're thirsty for you, Aries. Ooh, because you gave them the juice. You gave them that real passion, that real love, that real energy that they didn't get nowhere, okay? The grass was always fake. You were never the fool. You were always the goat. And you continue to be the goat, okay? And you're going all the way up, okay? And this is your victory. This is your blessing. This is your abundance. This is what you work for, my loves. No one is going to come and just take a piece of that pie. Uh-uh. I think you, I think not, okay? I think not. I think you got to be selfish for once. I think you got to be greedy with this pie, Aries. You work too hard for this. Yeah, you guys are, be, you guys are meant to be spiritual teachers. Can't make it up. You guys are spiritual teachers. You guys have ancient knowledge and ancient history from ancient Egypt and ancient tribes. Aries, yes. You guys are connected to, to, to ancient tribes. Aries, you guys have some powerful ancestors, let me tell you. Yeah. And somebody that you were with, their mom broke you guys up. Somebody's mom broke you up. It says my mom broke us apart. That's what that. How are you going to leave somebody you love for your mom? Grow up and man up or woman up. You don't let your mom make your decisions. That's when you know that person is pathetic, okay, and they can't make their own choices. You don't want nobody like that, Aries. You guys are receiving inheritance, like I said, spiritual inheritance, and you're receiving money and asset inheritance. So you, you guys are, for some of you, you're receiving both. You're receiving both. You got your spiritual gifts from your past life ancestors, and you're receiving an inheritance in this physical life. Yeah, that was kept from you guys. That was hidden from you guys. That's about to be exposed to. Just wait for it, Aries. Friends were in the way of your connection with this person. Yeah, this person mm -hmm, giving me a... This person needs to gain their strength. They need to gain their knowledge and, and their wisdom. They need to heal before you even entertain that energy, Aries, because you, against all odds, you woke up. Against all odds, you succeeded. Against all odds, you gained your energy, your strength back. Against all odds, you know the truth now. You woke up. And the same way you had to put the work in, and the same way you had to go through shit, and the same way you did it by yourself, let them do it, this, let them do it by yourself. Let them go through what they got to go through. Okay, you just keep winning, Aries. You just focus on you, my love. Don't focus on that. Don't feel guilty. That's not your problem. Nobody was losing sleep when you were going through the most. Nobody was worried about it when, when, when you didn't have nowhere to go and lay your head. Yeah, they weren't worried about it. They were doing them. Too busy, too busy laughing at you, Aries. Too busy thinking they broke you, Aries. Wow. Yeah, but you guys are shifting right now to fourth and fifth dimension. So you got to protect your energy the most because when you're going from fourth to fifth, any little bad energy could bring you back down. So Aries, don't let nobody's bad energy bring you down in ascension, my loves. You guys, this person is realizing you're the best they ever had. Wow. Baby, you my everything. Uh, I'm just hearing that Drake song. Baby, you are everything. Best I ever had. Hey. Wow. Now, right? Now, right? Now, right? Yeah. Yeah, because... This person was caught cheating, okay? Maybe the person that they went to got caught cheating and they cheated on this person and this person got their karma. Cause that's what I just heard. This person got cheated on that left you Aries because they get, they got exactly what they put out to you because your ancestors don't play. 
and um, the person they left you for, they're jealous because this person wants to come back to you. And you have a lot of people that are jealous. A lot of people. A lot of people. Okay, not just one. Yeah. And th and this person that tried to do love spells on you, they backfired, Aries. So if someone tried to do love spells on you, they backfired, and now they're obsessed with you. Can't make it up. That's what happens. <laughs> backfired. Yeah, because you guys are loving yourself. Yeah, you guys are too busy loving yourself. Wow, Aries, look what card popped out when I said that. I can't make it up. I said you guys are loving yourself when I was shuffling. Loving yourself popped out. Keep loving yourself because somebody that you were dealing with, Aries, mm -mm, bisexual secret. This person has a lot of uh, sexual demons. Wow, I just heard that. This person got sexual demons. They could have an STD. You better be careful who you, who you give your energy to, Aries. Be careful because... Wow, look what came up next. Yo, I'm on fire. Someone has an STD. Avoid them. Aries, this person has a bisexual secret. Oh, that's nasty. Yeah, so if this person's sick, they want to come bring you that. Don't receive that package. Aries, you guys are so good right now. Oh, my God. This is crazy, guys. Yeah. Then they're going to beg you. Please let me see you, Aries. Say no. Aries, Spirit got a new soulmate coming in for you guys. Spirit got a new love. Aries, you need to block them. Block them if you haven't blocked them. They're a stalker because they're sick now. And you have a new soulmate that's coming in for you, Aries. A new soulmate and a new love, a new abundance. It's a new season, Aries. Please choose wisely who you choose to share your beautiful pie of abundance with. Please don't share your pie of abundance with everyone that didn't help you get that. Okay? I love you guys so much, my beautiful baby bosses. This is your daily energy. I'll be back with you guys tomorrow. As always, I love you so much. Till next time, namaste.